Welcome back to my channel Traveling Soul Stay. Today's video is about how to cook cauliflower curry recipe. Cauliflower is very low in calories yet high in vitamins and minerals such as vitamin K, vitamin C and potassium, magnesium and phosphorus. It is high in fiber and full of antioxidants. So it helps in weight loss. To cook this curry, take a pan with half of water and add 1 tablespoon of turmeric and 1 tablespoon of salt and mix it well. Then add the cauliflower pieces which has been cut already. Cook the cauliflower for 10 to 15 minutes in this hot water. Meanwhile, let us prepare the creamy paste for this curry. Now, take 3 tablespoon of shredded coconut and 1 tablespoon of cumin seeds and 1 tablespoon of groundnut seeds and 1 tablespoon of cashew nut and 1 tablespoon of tomato. Grind it into thin paste and keep it aside. After 15 minutes, remove the cauliflower from the heat and keep aside. Take a new pan and add 2 to 3 tablespoon of oil. Now add 1 tablespoon of cumin seeds and 1 tablespoon of mustard seeds. Sort it well until it gets golden brown. Now add thinly sliced 1 medium sized onion. Cook until it gets soft. and then add one large size tomato and two green chilies. Cook for five more minutes and then add one tablespoon of ginger and one tablespoon of garlic paste. it well until the raw smell of the garlic disappears. Here I have taken pressure cooked yellow peas. I am going to add this to the curry. You can use green peas as well. I didn't have green peas so I am adding yellow peas here. You can cook without adding peas as well. But if you add peas it will add more flavor to the gravy. Now add 1 tablespoon of red chilli powder and 1 tablespoon of turmeric powder and 2 tablespoon of coriander powder and add 1 spoon of garam masala. If you don't have garam masala, it's not a problem. You need not add garam masala if you don't have. Add 
the grinded paste to this gravy and add one glass of water. well for 5 more minutes and then add the cooked cauliflower pieces into this gravy and add 2 spoons of salt remember you have already added salt while cooking cauliflower separately so add salt according to that and half glass of water and close the lid and let it cook for 10 more minutes can add coriander leaves if you have. Creamy cauliflower curry is ready to serve. You can serve this cauliflower gravy with chapati, dosa or idli or with rice. If you are working on your weight loss then have it with dosa or chapati for lunch. I hope you liked today's video. See you in my next video. Until then take care and bye bye. Before that don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click on the bell icon to get notifications if I post new video. See you, take care, bye bye.